Afternoon, guys. Uh, Gary Gray here again this week with Tyler Henderson. Going to do some uh, um, just kind of some Americana options from Mount that a lot of people skip. So let's uh, get right to it. Just a couple of short ones. So, anyway, so um, basically, everybody knows Americana, branch up, paintbrush, whatever, when they're driving this down. Um, a couple little tricks to getting this when he's all in tight here and I can't get to the keys, I can't get to his arms. So I'm going to match what he's doing here and just drive this down. Okay, and then slide off and get my Americana. Um, a lot of times what happens is you get this position, but you get a guy, before you get everything solidified, he starts thrashing around and starts getting out, okay? Um, a lot of times what happens from here is he starts moving around, he starts fighting, and I can't get it back here where I need to get it to get my submission. So if I can't get this here, as he's moving this around, I just simply do, I just bring it across right here. So as he's fighting, I have my figure four, I have that lock but I can't get his arm where I need to get it to submit it. So as he's fighting, I just kind of go with it, bring it across. When I do, I lay my forearm right on his neck and I lay on the back of his tricep here, so I'm holding his arm down. Now when he tries to move, it's pretty tight, okay? When you guys are doing this in class, be really careful when you come across, you don't jam these fingers and his wrist into the wrist, into the mat. So again, I'm trying to get this and he starts to bring it across right here and just lay on it. Now when he tries to move, it's good. From here, all I do, bring my knee up to his head, Switch this posture around right here. I still have this. Now he's pretty trapped. But just keep your figure four right here. Okay. Swing it around. Move. Just bring it right here for my arm lock. It's a really easy arm lock. So again, I'm driving this down. I get my hands locked, but I can't get it where I need it. Just fight and go with it. Bring it boom, right here. Here. Suck everything in tight. Stay up tight here. And then there's your arm lock. Pretty easy combo. Um, it's really pretty fundamentally easy to do. Um, you, you see it a lot. I mean, it just starts thrashing, and the guys panic on trying to get the arm back where it is, and they just let go instead of going to that. Another option I have is I get this, and there's three versions of what's going to happen. Um, sometimes he reaches through this hole here, okay? If he does, that's great. Okay, if he doesn't, go back with this. Um, I'll set this up by putting my arm out here and let him reach through that hole, because that's what I want. If he doesn't at all, go back, I'm here, he'll try to reach around to grab his hand now on the outside, I block. And then when I do that, he'll reach his hand through there. So either way, I want his hand through the middle. When that hand comes through there, forget about it for a second, just focus on this, bring your left knee up to the head, and now he's trapped, that arm leg. Right here, and I just bring this whole package over. Right here the arm So again, I'm driving this down, and he reaches around or reaches through. Okay, if he reaches through, great. If he reaches around, block it, and he reaches through. Just bring your knee up behind his shoulder. Keep your weight on here, and I just use this to pick. He tries to pull that arm down now. It's Everything's blocked over here. So I keep this here, bring this foot, and I just keep the figure four if you want. Just take this whole package. There's your arm on. Yeah, just have the whole thing. Um, another one that happens, a lot is I'll drive this down and he straightens his arm and it always goes right to there. And he just as he straightens his arm, as he straightens that arm, it always freezes. Straighten, he'll straighten that arm, it always stops right there. I still have the grip, but I can't get it to where I need it. So, what I'm going to do here, cement this hand together, squeeze my elbows together, and I'm going to keep his hand on the mat as I rotate his arm over the top. And you should get a submission right there. So. Um, when he straightens that arm, I'm not letting him get it completely out. He's just, you'll feel it stop, okay? So I'm here, he straightens his arm, it just stops right there. I just lay on it. Squeeze your elbows together, lay on it, and I just twist just the elbow. Okay. You don't want to do that for the regular Americana, but when he straightens that arm out, you can kind of rotate into it. So that's pretty much it. So those three kind of little options you have when you're getting an Americana that's kind of, it's kind of failing, you can uh, just keep that figure four because you do have that arm trap and you have a bunch of options. So that's it for this week. Thanks, guys. Uh, BJJReno.com.